Well, hello. Now, in 1741, if you'd have visited here, Adlington Hall, here in Cheshire, you would have seen quite an important person here, George Frederick Handel, and he would have been able to have visited an organ. So let's go and see it now. Well, someone's playing the organ now upstairs and uh, I think we can guess who it is, so let's go and see him. Oh, very nice, Jonathan. Very good. <laughs> Well, here we are at the wonderful organ of Adlington Hall, and I believe that uh, someone very important visited this instrument, Jonathan. I've just been telling everyone about it. Yeah, no, Handel visited here, I think in 1740, 1741 and 1751. Tell me a bit about the organ and why it's so special in terms of its sounds, as it got its unique character from uh, these very old pipes which are in it, probably. Uh, it's the oldest and largest unaltered instrument in the British Isles. Well. So 14 stops and they're all thought to be at least 1680s some of it might be from earlier um, they're not entirely sure um, it didn't play for a long time it was restored in the 50s so it's completely original for the sound they think mm -hmm. um, the tuning is original as well so you get this very basic principle sound but you'll hear oh yes there's some, some quite painful sounds there yeah. Brighter, so you can't play in certain, certain, certain keys. Playing. Okay. Yeah. Just can't play, but certain keys. And tell me about some of these sounds here. We've got. Uh, so lots the, of yeah, stops, these letters. You we? see, they've got the original paper stops oh, signs underneath. That. Yeah, that, that, yeah, I can see that. Yes. So they're the original from wow. the late 1600s. And they put these ones on top yes. so, so you can see. Go on, point out an interesting. Uh, so the interesting stop. ones are the reeds because it's the largest oh. collection of original reeds. So there's a so, bassoon okay, on the bottom, aren't you? Uh, yeah, and there's a trumpet is very important because there's a lot of trumpet tunes from there. Oh, wait, I think we've got a... That's nice. Oh, so it's got some uh, quite low sounds. No pedals on this, no, no pedals. But, there's no uh, pedals. There was a, oh, shall I show you the pedal board? Oh yes, go on then. I believe there is a pedal board. <laughs> but, he's gone, he's gone. Someone's moved it. So this is the pedals they had made for it originally. Oh right, okay. There's a hole um, at the, uh, the bottom of here, isn't there? That isn't the right way up, sorry. Okay, time. and it's the other way up. Because it only plays one way. That's fine. It's very odd, it plays that way down, you see. Oh, You'd right. never be able to play it with your feet. It's too... It looks like someone wants... Do you think there was something on top of this? Do you no, think, no, that, that hooks, it's, it's yeah. not any sharps on. Yeah. Well, these would hook onto the inside there, yeah. but the, the mechanism's there. Yeah. But you can't play it. It's someone who's seen a, a pedal board from abroad and tried to make one. Fantastic. And had a complete disaster, really. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. So there's no pedals, but... At, le at least they had a go. And that's the main thing, isn't it? <laughs> but, um, yeah, fantastic stuff. Uh, and uh, I believe you'll be playing some exciting music. One of your pieces One of my well. pieces. Well, I didn't, like to, I didn't like to mention. So that, while, I, yeah. while, I, while I leave, why don't you just give me a burst of one of my pieces, then? <laughs> Your piece. Look, of course I want my piece. So, um, Jonathan will now tie his own bow tie without the aid of a mirror. It must be said that, that I just use one of those that uh, is already tied. Are you ready? Okay, yeah, pretty good. <laughs> Jonathan just stood in a load of mold. <laughs> what are you saying? What? It's a mole hill. Oh, look very smart, Jonathan, in front of Adlington Hall. Do you want me to stand here? Well, you are stood there. <laughs> 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 you can hear the seagulls, we're in Bridlington, 
and behind me is St. John's Methodist Church where Jonathan will be performing tonight. Right, buzzing in Bridlington. What, what are you fixing, Jonathan? Oh, that's fine. Fix the buzzing. That's good. Oh. Are you not on the right height, Jonathan? I've got a couple of books. I've brought my box. I thought it's an old... It's from the 1890s. Let's see, I've got my name on it. Oh, yeah. There you go, strength. That pedal's very interesting. It been, it's, probably, it's probably been a ratchet somewhere here. It looks very, here. Um, it's a very uh, heavy duty. Yeah, it's what year is this album? 1893. So says that look. But the only way of changing stops are these pedals at the bottom. So I push this one down. Yep. The stops here come out. Oh, right, okay. So I'll push another one down. And and it's got these funny old-fashioned round ends. Mm. Pedal cover's not. I'm just. Have you got your finger trapped? <laughs> course, it's not. When you press the note, it's not covered. I don't need to take the front off. I can fold Ah, the mechanics at work. This is the coupler here. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the, the mechanism there. Yeah. And it's adjusted as much as it can be up there, so if I adjust it at this end. Mm. Yeah, there. For that. You'll need that for Vido Toccata. The main danger of this is don't burn your head on the 100 watt light bulb strip. <laughs> <laughs> it's absolutely it's top advice. And these are the pedal mechanisms. The whole pedal mechanism is in here. Fixed. It's fixed. Brilliant. Jonathan at the organ <laughs> of Bridlington Priory. Peering <laughs> through. It's like a shop window. <laughs> ah, so this is Bridlington Harbour. Very nice. Jonathan, get in the shop. There we go, Bridlington right. Harbour. We were here. Fantastic. Right, time for an ice cream is and it? a candy floss. Is it? No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. You're not having one of them. Can't have one. It's like a a scene from a certain film. What? <laughs> uh. And here we are. The dressing room. And uh, interesting feature of this dressing room. A zebra's head. And as I was just saying, you just don't get them anymore, do you, Jonathan? Yeah, Not as many as you used to. Um, <laughs> I've been given the task of uh, turning the organ on, so... Job done. Jonathan's here. Bridgewater Hall tomorrow, Jonathan. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, it's Don't start this again. Ah, registrations. I've got to, I set the organ for about six weeks ago. Lights are done, looking good. That's all. That's good. What are you doing? I set this for about six weeks ago. Load, save. I'm loading the settings onto the organ. Load, question mark, load. I'm waiting until that goes fixed. off and it'll be back on. The first movement of Brandenburg Concerto number three. Well, Jonathan, you've just done a sound test and uh, 
He sounded lovely. <laughs> dramatic. Jonathan, Hello. I cannot let you carry on without asking you a few <laughs> questions about this wonderful organ. It's fantastic. This is the Marcuson organ of the Bridgewater Hall. It, it 76 is 76 stops. Um, and the unusual thing is they're sort of uh, like old North German Dutch style. So when you put an octave on, it's not just one rang. You'll hear the notes settle because there's two or three pipes burn up. Wow. So it's, so it gives it's, it's, it's a very expressive sound. sound yeah. So the big old North German Dutch style, it's built in that style really. So it's a mechanical organ, but... It's mechanical upstairs. upstairs. This is an electric console, but it pulls all the trackers down electrically. So it's exactly the same sound down here as up there. And is it connected via that, this? That's mainly power cable. The little, oh, red, right. the little red cable is the optic fan. Oh, I see. Okay. It's all through that. The rest and of it goes just to power the console. up to a computer at the top, I take it. Yeah. Wonderful. Well, it's great in the hall. Um, so you've got just about everything you would have. You've got two lots of strings, you've got your normal Celeste, and then you've got your Undermaris, which is tuned the other way. This is a bit more... You've got your big cornet type sounds. That's a lovely sound. Uh, then you've got your Chamard, two of them. clarinet as well. It's just got so many beautiful sounds on. Fantastic. Jonathan, I'll let you carry on with your rehearsal for today's concert. Thank you very much. Hello there. Um, I've got a front row seat. It's fantastic. Assessing of the wall. Backstage. No zebra's head. <laughs> no zebra's head. So look, there's a picture of the uh, the organ here as it was being put in. Fantastic. My watch is the wrong time. Well, it's, it's almost show time. Anyway, very busy today. I'm just doing a bit of filming. Um, can't wait for the concert.